Jesus. Now in the name of Jesus. Now in the name of Jesus, I touch your face. I touch those ears. Jesus name. Now I touch your chest. Your push come. Tell you why. She grew up very tough. She never told you. She never told you. She, she did. Huh? She did tell you. She told you. So you have to leave it, uh, you must not enter deep into that, because otherwise you are destroying the, uh, you can destroy that church, you destroy the family, the prophecy is very dangerous, very dangerous. So how would you feel if you hear that uh, this man is a pastor, he's got a church, but he's got a church, can you see now? So now, we need to fear God. If we have got people that are the mortal people like us, who can speak these things, whatever you do, God is watching you like this. So now, you must be careful with your steps. Whatever you do, involve Holy Spirit. So as I'm telling you about this young woman, if we hate other people, they are hating God. It's not going to be good for us. You know, we are on this earth. We still have the favorites of God. You heard them. God acts quickly. When I'm speaking with you, this thing wants to enter my ears now. God acts quickly. Remember the word of God say, "God said I hate Israel, and I love Jacob." 
you can only question me why is he saying that because you there's a greater life for you on it you are still with you i'm feeling the power of god that is coming to in the name of Jesus. My name is Busiso Chabango. <coughs> um, I came here for one on one <coughs> so that I can hear what God is saying um, in relation to where I want to go business wise um, about marriage. I just also wanted God to to perfect my my healing and um, to know about the family as well. Um, pertaining to business, I, I recently started because prior I started this poultry and it didn't work. And um, there was a time during the service the prophet prophesied about um, this farming and how God is going to give me money. So now um, I actually wanted to know that as I'm starting the, um, this farming, what is God saying? Right. Um, regarding the, the work issue, the, at work you can't just get the promotion without certain required papers that will make you to be incumbent for the position. So now um, I needed to study so that I can get get the better credentials so that I can get the position right and therefore um, in relation to the family um, I I wanted God to intervene in my family because I believe there's a struggle of um, ancestral spirits and <clears throat> Sangoma spirit and that has been disturbing a lot in my spirit. There was a time also I would have the I don't know should I say it's anxiety or depression because of I was worried about um, my health of which prior I was um, diagnosed with um, the, the retroviral so um, the prophet prayed for me in last day June and then I found out um, when I went to test that God has healed me. So now that has been um, a thought that disturbed me. So now I needed to, <clears throat> to get some clarity of which um, I went to the doctors and then I tested then I found out I'm healed of which um, 
today I got another clarity again. Mm-hmm. Um, <coughs> when something it's okay, this is how it was affecting me. You know, when you are always thinking about something, and especially when things they are not integrating the way you you desire them to become. Therefore, um, especially when this poultry started, it failed before and due to the reason of no money and no land to execute the plan and etc etc um so now <coughs> it was affecting me because i <coughs> i knew that this is where the prosperity lied so now perhaps i can do it um i will see the the, the grace of god so and um when it comes to the family it's it's kind of like disturbing to know that there's Jesus who can deliver the family and what else they are clinging to what they believe it's working for them so now um i actually wanted god also to deliver them either through me or by any means but um <coughs> it's it was disturbing of course um today i met with the man of god prophet andris and the the first impression it was good because he <coughs> he asked me about the the work and then i said no at work everything is okay and then he therefore said but i see that you 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 want to get a better job i said okay um at work you can't um get a better position if you don't have certain credentials of which um i'm currently busy studying so he said yes that's what i'm seeing because i see that now this is causing you to sit behind the table and study and <coughs> uh, he said um he believes god will help me after here I will get the better promotion. Mm. He therefore said, I see the house. God wants to give you the house. I said, yes, um, already God has given me the house. I'm now staying in there. The only thing that is left, I signed with the attorneys. The only thing that is left with it is um, the, that they launch because of they were just waiting for the clearance certificate and then he therefore said because now i see this um that place it will tend to be a business um i said man of god that is true because already as we speak i started in the yard this poultry he also asked me about the the lady that i want to marry and then i okay he asked me where is she and then i they went in the golf and he <coughs> he was just <laughs> giving the the word of advice in that regard uh, i don't know how am i going to put it but he was just giving the word of advice and um telling us things that we should be cautious of um the things that he actually said it is that um God is going to help us so that we 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 take each other. He was asking the a question of saying um are we I am am I really really sure that I want to marry or something like saying are you ready for this, you know? And therefore he said um <coughs> God is going to help us and <coughs> the only thing that we ought to be careful of is that we we should not fall into sin you know and live right i believe the last word that he gave with it was um when he said um the lord is releasing a certain anointing and that is the one that is gonna god is gonna use it through me to to deliver also the family because i also needed to know about um they are they are bus- uh, they are people who are who endeavor to partner with me in business so now i needed to know um 
the rightful destiny help us least i make mistake you see sorry so now um the the man of god just said um if they are from god they will stay if not uh, with time god will chase them away so now i'm happy that whatever that i came here for um the man of god by the grace of god he managed to to touch everything and i'm happy well um i believe the the way i can say encourage somebody out there um is the way that the man of god has given the advice to me that i should pray because um all this happens or the feeling of depression or frustrations whatever that happens how you feel at the moment is because of when prayer is being attacked so now the man of god also mentioned that um satan is attacking my prayer and today i'm up tomorrow i'm down and that's when i also confirmed because whenever time my prayer life it's cold that's when I'm realizing that uh, uh, wrong things are happening and I'm thinking not in cynic with the word of God. So now um, I can encourage somebody out there that um, pray uh, Jesus first as the man of God has said and the rest shall follow.